assalamu alaikum this is imran and welcome to the class 11 in this class we are going to fit the image into the frame so let's get it started we have got this image let's say i want to copy or move this image to another image to do that we are going to use marquee tool hit second key down now kill hold and drag i want to copy this part then move the selection i am still on the marquee tool and i can just move that selection till i find it's kind of like so i have got this bit here to take a copy of this image to another document there are a couple of ways first one is by using the move tool kill hold and drag the selected area up there and here we are now release the mouse key to fit the image into the frame we are going to edit free transform now you can still hold to get the corners to do what you want make it look like there is an image in frame and you can see the image isn't fit in the frame what should we do now to fit this in the frame with the z size Let's learn how to do it now. With this layer selected, press delete to rid of it. We are going to make exact size selection of this frame. Grab your marquee tool. Aim is the shortcut key of marquee tool. Make selection of frame. Now kill hold the selection. and drag to the image and release the mouse button here move it down a little bit now we have the exact size of frame to select this part second way to copy image to another image is select any part of image that you want to copy press control c if you are a mac user press command c to copy go back to the frame press control v to paste on mac command v looks like fit cool huh if you think it isn't fit here if you are getting it close zoom in image we can use our keys on our keyboard so i am just tapping my arrow keys on my keyboard but it's not moving do you know why Because we are marquee tool. Press V. V is the shortcut key of move tool. And now you can use the arrow keys on your keyboard. You can just use that for kind of like fine adjustment. Press Control Zero to zoom out. On Mac, it's Command Zero. Let's see another example to learn a few extra tricks. So we have this super awesome Apple LED. Let's say I want to change this image. I want this little part of the image. Make a quick selection. And grab the move tool. Kill, hold, and drag to the frame out. Release the mouse button here. Press Control T on Mac Command T to transform it. But it's not gonna fit. Press back space to delete the image. Let's use our super tech. Make selection of the screen. Drag it to the image or two. Now we have exact size selection to select the image. Move it around a little bit and grab the move tool. Tilt, hold, and drag to the frame or two. Release it here and move the image a little bit 
with the help of arrow keys to fit the screen. Let's say I want another background here. Let's go to image or two and drag the selection. Oops, we are using new tool. Press Ctrl Z to undo. On Mac, it's Ctrl Z. Press A with Marty to drag the selection to another part of the image. This is good. This is too good. I like it. Now press Ctrl C to copy. On Mac, it's Ctrl C. Go back to frame or two. Press Ctrl V to paste. On Mac, it's Ctrl V. Hide the layer one. With layer 2 selected, let's fit the image into a screen. Now we have two backgrounds here for a screen. Let's save the image, go to file, then save. I want to save JPEG. To change the type of file, click on here and select JPEG. Give it a name and hit save button. This window appears. Here you can select file size and quality. Click OK. We saved our first image. Let's save frame of view. Turn on and off iBot to see which one is the best. I think this looks better than other image. Same process to save the file. Choose the quality of your image. I select maximum quality. It ok. Let's go and check our file. This is good. This one is pretty awesome. Let's go and open up the project file. I am giving you the kind of base here. What are you going to do is find another thing for this frame here. Unsplash is a good place for high quality images. Go find an image and see if you can put something in that frame. It can be anything you like. So post it on social media. In Instagram, it's a model designer. Tag me in it. I'd love to see what you do. On Twitter, I am Imran Ali Artist. Alright friends, go have fun with this one. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.